Introduction. A day that started wrong. The day began like any other, but quickly took a turn for the worse. It seemed like everything that could go wrong did. Small annoyances piled up, creating a feeling of frustration and helplessness. Then the final straw. My washing machine broke down. Suddenly a simple chore became an insurmountable obstacle. It was a familiar feeling, one we all experience. Life throws us curveballs, leaving us feeling overwhelmed and stuck. But this time, I decided to face, face the challenge head on. Little did I know, fixing my washing machine would become a metaphor for tackling life's bigger obstacles. Section 1, the broken appliance, my washing machine, a trusty companion for years, had suddenly become a silent, uncooperative beast. Clothes piled up, the familiar hum replaced by an unsettling quiet. Initially, I felt a wave of panic. Calling a repair person meant waiting, disruption, and an unwelcome expense. The easy option would be to give in, to accept defeat, and let someone else handle it. But a spark of defiance ignited within me. Why should I surrender to this inconvenience? I could at least try to understand the problem. Maybe, just maybe, I could fix it myself. I took a deep breath and began to examine the machine. I opened the user manual, its pages filled with diagrams and technical jargon that seemed daunting at first. Yet I persevered, determined to decipher its secrets. Each unfamiliar term, every complex diagram, became a puzzle to solve. Slowly I started to make sense of the inner workings of my once reliable appliance. With every piece of information I absorbed, my confidence grew. The initial fear was replaced by a sense of purpose, a drive to conquer this challenge. Section 2, Facing My Fears. I knew this wouldn't be easy, the thought of tinkering with wires and machinery. Something I had never done before was intimidating. Doubts crept in, whispering tales of failure and frustration. What if I made things worse? What if I couldn't fix it? These anxieties were natural, but I refused to let them cripple me. I remembered a valuable lesson. Grit, the power of passion and perseverance, was essential for overcoming any obstacle. I decided to take a measured approach. I watched online tutorials, taking notes and replaying sections until I felt confident. Each step I took, each screw I tightened, brought me closer to my goal. The process was slow, often frustrating, but I refused to give up. Hours passed, filled with moments of doubt and small victories. But throughout the process, I felt a sense of accomplishment. I was learning, adapting, pushing beyond my comfort zone. And then it happened, a final click, a satisfying hum, and the washing machine sprang back to life. The feeling of triumph was exhilarating. I had done it. I had faced a challenge, persevered, and emerged victorious. The pile of laundry, once a symbol of defeat, now represented a hard-earned victory. But the significance of this experience went far beyond a repaired appliance. It was a testament to the power of human resilience, a reminder that we are capable of more than we often believe. This seemingly insignificant event had a profound impact on my outlook. It taught me the importance of facing challenges head on, of embracing the unknown with courage and determination. It reinforced the belief that within each of us lies the potential to overcome obstacles, big or small. The next time life throws a curveball, I will remember the washing machine. 
I will remember the power of grit, the satisfaction of perseverance, and the joy of triumph. The broken washing machine became a symbol of, of something much greater. It represented the everyday challenges we all face, the moments that test our resolve and make us question our abilities, but it also highlighted the immense power of human resilience, the capacity to learn, adapt, and overcome. We all have the potential to fix our own washing machines, to tackle the obstacles that stand in our way. The key is to embrace the challenge, to persevere with grit and determination, and to never underestimate the power of our own potential.